Hi everybody. This is the uh, the cross I did last night, and I decided to go back in and do some embellishment. And this right here is a uh, like a coral that uh, they're beads actually, but they're cor like coral, and I really love them. I haven't used them in anything yet, but for some reason this seemed really soothing to me. It just hit my spirit, and I'm like, I'm going with this. And we're going to have some red glitter. So, uh, plus I needed to give a top coat to it anyway. So I'm hoping I got enough resin made up. I've just put it in the cup. So I've just started stirring. It'll be just a couple minutes. And we'll be ready to go. Um, hope everybody out there is doing really well tonight. Um, well, tonight, today, this afternoon. <laughs> Wherever you are that you're watching this. I really love this piece. I love the way it come out. I will be getting some more of these to do some more. Um, and, and also, too, because they have a little metal ring at the top of them. Uh, it's about, about that big. Um, the, I'll, I'll, it, it's screwed in with tiny screws, and I'll screw it back in when I get everything done and get the back off of it, like I shared uh, last night about it. And... At that time, I'll put that back on and be able to hang it really easy. It'll be nice. The coasters that I did last night, I wanted to show you how they came out. I love the way they came out. They came out really nice. Once they cured, it was it was not too much like um, or too much unlike they were when uh, when we finished them. However. One did come out kind of like an orange. I was so surprised. I don't know how that happened. I guess maybe something in the mixture between the gold and the um, red somehow. And But it didn't do like that on the other ones. It stayed a true red on the other ones. So I'll show you those in just a minute before I actually do this. <clears throat> Excuse me. This is the one that came out like an orange, right? It's very, very pretty, but um, yeah, it came out kind of like an orange. I like the, I don't know if you can see really good the webbing that come in, that happened through here, but I like the way this one turned out. I like all of them. They turned out really good. Um, here's another one. And uh, all five um, came out really nice. This one's like a big web over the other colors uh, like a big uh, lacing almost like a spider red with something over the other colors i really like that i like the effect how it came out they're all so different from each other uh, this one here i like how it came out really nice right um, i love this over in here you can see it yeah Okay, and the last one, this one here, and it has some nice uh, kind of webbing effects too. Uh, most of y'all call it lacing. Sometimes to me it kind of looks like, a, it reminds me of a web, of spider webs, but it is supposed to be called lacing. However, you know, my art, I call it what I want to, um, yeah, but it's lacing, I guess, but uh. For me, webbing, webbing. Anyway, so that's, that's how those come out. They come out really nice. I think I like them. I'm surprised we got five out of them, but that's cool. Everybody usually likes black and red and gold and black and red and white and gold. Those are nice colors. Um, I want to get some of these, though, some of these crosses like this because they're in really nice size. Uh, and do, let me see exactly the size of it. Tell you in a second the size. Okay. The width is uh, right around nine and a half inches. The length is about 12 and a half inches. So that's really a good size, right? And so, um, you know, you can put embellishments on it and stuff because it's so big. You can work with it pretty nice. And so, um, 
I was kind of hoping for this to get a little bit thick anyway, so that's why I'm continuing to stir it. Uh, so I'm going to see how I can get this. Um, I'm hoping to get this. this uh, oh, maybe I might need. There we go. A stick. I'm hoping to get this glitter to come out really nice on it. I know I'm going to have too much glitter. I put too much in here. That's okay, though. And we're going to just stick that to the side for a minute. And I'm going to go ahead and put these down here. Uh, put this down here over, over the things I've got on here. Because we need to make sure they get locked in good. I got my cat in the room and he is having a fit to come out. I put a picture of him on my Instagram um, on the bed that uh, he has now with this stuffed little plushy doggy that um, is so cute. And I put the picture because, like, this is how he sleeps. He sleeps with this dog now, and he used to sleep with me, right? He don't sleep with me anymore. He sleeps with this dog and has his um, his paw and his, you know, like his arm all up on him and stuff, like hugging him. <laughs> like, okay, got his own pet now. So, yeah, he digs it and he really, really loves it. So, this is cool, whatever. You know, I'm happy that he's happy. We all want our pets to be happy. Okay, let's, let's get some through here. I'm just dripping it everywhere, but it's all right. I ain't hurting nothing. Oh my gosh, my cat's having a fit, y'all. He's so, so bossy. <laughs> really, he's so bossy. I'm going to just spread this around some. Make sure I can get it on the edges good. Then I'm going to go and bust the bubbles in it. And uh, in a couple of minutes, we'll put down some of the glitter. I'm wondering if I shouldn't have built some wall around this a little bit. Something to think about for the next one, right? Make it almost like a geode style. Could actually do a geode in it, too. I'm always thinking of different things to... To do, you know, um, I've got so many ideas floating around in my head. I wish I had the money for all the the uh, supplies for all the ideas that I have. <laughs> yeah, it would be going on all of the time. Which I do this every day. I do something in art every single day, from the time I get up till the time I go to bed. I'm thinking about art, y'all. I even dream about it. You know, it's crazy. I'll get up and, and have dreamt about some kind of something different to try, you know. Um, it's really neat. I'm, I'm so thankful for the uh, gift of art. I really am. 
Okay, let me see. I need a little bit more over here. Make sure we have everything covered really good. Why does it keep going off of there? I didn't know that it was so so much stuck on there. Okay, yeah, that feels a little bit better there. A little more um, even. So we'll see in a little bit here. I'm going to go, I'm going to get up and do the torch, do the torch a little bit and get these air bubbles out in just a minute. Let me see here. Yep, need a little bit more up here. Okay. So one of the female cats has come in the door, y'all. <laughs> um, they get fed outside, but I don't know where she's coming in. She's coming in to go eat his food out the kitchen. Oh my goodness. <sighs> she's got the same food that he's got. She's got it outside. Oh well. And the cat, the, these are feral cats, and this feral cat's coming in my house. I guess she's so used to eating outside, right here by the door on the, on the porch, um, is where I feed them. That she's just, and this is kind of his girlfriend anyway. This is her main, main squeeze, y'all. His main girlfriend, you know. So, what am I doing? Torch. Here we go. Lighting, the lighting. Got to get more lighting. Not quite enough in here. Yeah. I got enough uh, resin left over for another coaster or two. But I don't have any colors out, so let's see. I'll have to see what kind of colors I want to put out. Y'all excuse me for just a minute, okay? I'm right here. I haven't gone anywhere, just trying to make some room on this other table to put my uh, to put my cross in a few minutes. I've been rearranging some in my studio to uh, you know to have more room to do some work. But uh, what I was actually doing today was putting up some things on the wall behind me. I'll eventually do a live one here, and when I do, I want to have. You know, some of my stuff looking nice on the wall behind me, <laughs> right? So, yeah, I was doing that today, and I'm still still got a long ways to go, but um, little by slow, I'll get it. Okay, let's see here. I don't know if I want to put it right on it or down beside it. Um, I do know that I think I want to use one of these yep oh no it's got a hair on it it's not good okay got it on okay all right so we're gonna drip some right in here follow this line here okay and that's all that's going to be on this side is um just that. Just to give it a little balance because um Thought about putting a few of them over here, but I like it how it is. So uh, let me see. If I run a little bit over them, what is it going to do? Hmm. Not bad. I kind of like that.
Okay. I'll stand up so I can see this really good. We'll run them over these ones, and then the other side we'll just run it beside it. On this side here. This side. That side. Yeah, there we go. I like that. Really do. Okay, let's see. I don't necessarily want red for for the other coasters that I have alone, but Try some red and blue or something like that. I oh, don't know. Didn't mean to have that there. I'm gonna do something different with that. Now. I'm going to do it on this side here. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Like that right I think I want to do a coaster. I think I want to do some molds. Maybe we'll do a red glitter something something. <laughs> yep, a red glitter uh hmm. Peacock. That sounds good, right? Regular peacock. Okay, that's done. That's all I want to do to it. That's it. I don't want to do anything else to it. That's it. So, what I'm going to do is go sit over here for a minute. So, you all bear with me. Oh, wait. Uh-oh. Let me make sure I got enough. Uh-huh. Enough of this on here. Let me make sure I got enough of that. Oh, it didn't look right for a minute there. Okay. I'll go back and check it in just a couple of minutes, but, uh, Oh, I think I got something in it. Let me get my little towel out. I did. And a hair in it. Let me look at it for a second. Let me make sure. Uh, uh. Okay. All right, I'm gonna move this to the other table and I'll be right back and we'll do a couple molds. Haven't been going anywhere, you guys. Didn't leave you. I am right here. Oh, I'm gonna get my little tiny uh, cover. 
I use food covers, you guys, for my heart. The pieces that's small enough anyway. The little, you know, like uh, net food covers that you can get for for um. Ooh, yeah, let's do a druzy mold. And let me see what else. I like these little bookmark things. They're kind of cool. And where's my, there she is. <laughs> the girl here. All right. So I don't know if we have room for all this, but we'll have some. Some, some, some. Hey, let's do a red and black. That'd be pretty. Okay, here we go. We'll use a little bit of this. Oops. Not with that stick. <laughs> Not with that stick, girl. Just a little bit. We don't need much at all. Mm -hmm. And I need to clean this off. Look. I get this all over me every time I open this, so I really need to clean it off. Oh my goodness. Messy, messy, messy artist. Sure. And what else can we do? A little bit of something. Okay, I'll do it like that. A little bit of something else over here. Not sure what yet. We'll figure it out. Okay. There we go. All right, so I'm thinking some of the Merlot. Merlot, I gotta find out how to pronounce it correctly. Some of the Merlot in here. Ooh, ooh, don't need that much. Really don't need all that much at all. And I'm thinking, let's do some peacock green. Oh, I messed up with that. Can't get it with that end. Can get it with that end though. Sure can. Okay, and we've got glitter. So this one's gonna be because I put the powder in last, you guys. I do the micro powder. I do have to slow it. Do it. Uh, excuse me. Stir it. Words. Words. Stir it slowly. To start off with, there we go. Okay. All right, there we go. That is the prettiest blue right there. It says peacock green, okay? But you guys, it does not look green. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's like a beautiful turquoise. Oh my goodness, I'll have to get more of that when it runs out because, yeah, I love this. It's just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. This is Lorez Peacock Green. That's absolutely just, I gotta show you. Look, look, look. I hope this light shows. Can you see that? Can you just see that right there? Look at that. That is fantastic. And the Merlot, Merlot, whatever, you, however you pronounce it, that's Lorez also. And this is uh, Midnight Black. This is Lorez too. Um, if you don't know, you can tell by now. I, I really like Lorez products, probably the most of all. But there's some other ones that's out there that I really like. Just Resin is really nice. And um, Color Arts, awesome. I don't have a whole lot of either one of them, but I do have a couple of each. 
And soon I'll have some yellow and orange because I didn't have any of that either. But we should have some of that soon. Okay, so let's see what we're going to do here. All right, I really want to uh, give her a nice... on her head. I want to give her some nice... Nice, nice. Uh, there we go. Glitter. Yep. On her head and the top of her body. I want her to have some nice glitter. Starting to set a little bit. The glitter I've, I, I made pretty thick anyway. And... But I can always put something, do something to it to thin it out a little bit. I know how to do that. <laughs> yeah, we can we can do some things. A little bit here and there. Also want to put some of this in the druzy. I'm thinking. Hope it'll come out okay. Not sure. Not sure about that. We'll see. So, um, hmm. Huh. Yeah. Let's go ahead and Put the rest of that up there on with a uh, glitter. Fill in the rest of that with glitter. You know what? I want to book bookmark with glitter. These are so cool. I've made a couple of these, and they're just really, really cool. I like them. They're very thin, and I find that at the part where you put a ribbon or something in it to, you know, be able to hold it. Oh, gosh, there's a bookmark. Girl, you're making a mess. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's get that up and in. Yeah, I find that in that part of it, um, it's so, so thin when it's done that when it cures that I'm not real, real, you know, happy with how thin it is. But I know it's supposed to be thin for it to be a bookmark. You know, I get that. So what I started doing is, um, I'll show you when I get some out. What I started doing was putting a little bit of um, glue, 600 glue around the tip of it, like right across here, like right across here, where the thing comes in. And once it's cured, you know, then I run a little bit of glue across there just to secure it really good. That's all. That's all it's for. Okay, here we go. Yeah, let me do something over here. A little bit of black. I have to be so delicate with these. Uh, you know, these little small flat things like this. But, um... I enjoy it. I love it. I love being able to do this. I really do. It's been my pet peeve. I want to do the, there's little holes in here, okay, in this. This is the peacock. And there's little holes that go in that they, when it's cured, it looks almost like diamonds on the outside. It shines. It's really pretty. And I want to try to put the black down in that, and then I'm going to go over it with some blue. So it's going to be black, red, and blue. Let's see how that looks. I like to do different things, you know. I've done the natural colors of peacocks with a few of them. And while they are very beautiful, um, I just like to do some different ones sometimes. Okay, now we're going to go in with the blue. Okay. 
We can do this. We can do this on this part. Mm-hmm, there we go. I didn't need a little toothpick. Oops, here we go. Now, this over here is not quite full enough in that red, so what I'm gonna do, oh, I got a little bead there. What I'm gonna do is uh, top this off with a little bit of this red, okay? And this is the Merlot red. And when we top it off with this, it really won't show through quite so much. It's going to show when I take it out, it's mostly on the other side. It's going to be what's really going to be looking, what everybody's going to look at. And the other side's mostly going to be glitter, just glitter showing on the top part here. Which this is absolutely pretty, <laughs> very pretty through here. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah, like it, like it, like it. I do, I do, I do. I'm just partial to the colors so much, I swear. Such beautiful, beautiful colors. Okay, now I really want this blue and black to kind of just do its own thing down here. I'm trying to mix it up just a little bit. And get some of the air bubbles out of it as well. Push a little bit of that glitter back up there if I can. And get some of that blue to go up there. There we go. Like it, you know, let it kind of blend in a little bit. All right. And uh, let me see. A little tiny part through there that you really can't see on this camera but uh when it comes out it's just a little tiny piece that comes out it's like a, a piece of the the feathers you know it's really nice really nice so um yeah let me try to get this blue over here and see what it does more of this black up here. Just a little touch of that blue for the contrast. Just something make it stand out. You know? Okay, the rest will be in this red here. That should pretty much do it. Should pretty much do it. Okay, and um, huh. Yeah, enough to do something else too. All right, so I, I want to do uh, a red and blue jersey. Let's see how that comes out. That should be interesting. Maybe it should show up as a little kind of purplish, like I'm thinking, right? Because blue and red. We'll see, I'm gonna get in there with a toothpick and stir it up a little bit too. I 
But yeah, I like the last one I did. Uh, um, the first one is the only one I've done so far, uh, besides this one. And it just really came out so nice. I was like, well, you know what? I'll probably make a necklace or something out of it. It's really nice. This looks like a little mini piece of geode. So, not very, very nice. Okay, this should be it right there. Let's see here. We're doing two things here. We're mixing it up and busting some bubbles a little bit. Air bubbles, air bubbles. Oh, that's something in it there. Get that out. Get that out. Okay. Let's see what it's going to do. We shall see. Once it cures, you know, I'll definitely um, let you guys see the end result of it. Might be a little bit left of this over here. Can do. Yeah, so it's spot down here. This blue needs to be in. I like that. That's going to be beautiful, I believe. I believe it's going to be just beautiful. Trying to get it on a little more level piece here. It don't seem to be quite level or something. Okay, let's see here. Clean this to cure off good. Get all this uh, glitter off of it. This is one of my A2D sticks. And I use them over and over and over and over, y'all. I can't tell you how long I've had them. I think ever since they very first come out with them. Maybe not very first, because um, I, I was not one of the first people to get them, that's for sure. But I've had them a long time. All right. Oh, I got a little bit left. Okay. Need... Uh, let me see what we got. We can do. <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm going to throw this in here so that we can do a little necklace out of this one. The red, and there's a little tiny bit of black left, too. So, I like this. All right. Well, I don't know if I left room for the black, did I? Hmm. Don't think I did. No. Don't think I did. That's okay. That's a pretty red right there. Well, it really is. A little bit of something in here. All right. Now, yeah. design time. Let me see. Cut through there. I want that. Get this to flow. There we go. Okay, that'll be pretty. It looks like we can get a couple more too. So, let's do this one. Hold up. Let me get the red and the black in there oh, at the top of it. Do the bottom of it, and uh, yeah, that's gonna be a nice little blend there. 
Oh, I might have gotten taken over by the red. A little bit left, though. All right. Let me see. This down. It's already pretty. Turn that down. Oh, yeah. That's pretty. Nice design. Nice design. It's just going to be kind of funky. Something for the kids, you know. You can do a little art show or something. People like to have small stuff to walk away with, from what I understand. So. Mm, I lost my black pretty much in there, but that's all right. Okay. So, you guys, we have a little druzy. We have two little pieces that's going to be necklaces. We have a little thing here that's going to be a um, bookmarker. And my trusted, wonderful, beautiful, because I love the, the uh, peacocks. They come out so pretty. And that's it. And for today, I'm done. I'm finished with all of this, and I hope that you all enjoyed it. I hope that you have a wonderful, wonderful evening. Do something creative, guys. Brighten up your world. Do something creative, whether it's art, whether it's music, dance. Do something creative. Go see something creative. Get out into the world and see beauty. All you got to do is look at Mother Nature. Show somebody some love out there, man. Until next time, love and peace. I'm out.